been written. Guys, I'm growing my hair out. I'm trying to get cornrows. Don't. Sorry. <laughs> Guys, welcome to our extra time segment. Um, yeah, so let's just. Let's, let me let's kick this off. Leeds, what's going on? Hey, Leeds. Hey. Beyonce, hey. Beyonce. I was going to say cojones for him because, boy, hey. everyone, was, everyone, hey. wanted, everyone wanted to take more high ground. Everyone wanted to. Hey. Oh, I can't believe he did that. That is what? so aff. Like, that is so ah. He literally did it. I said what I said. I literally, I did. Man said, I did. Man admit, first man admit, oh yeah, I spied, I spied on all of you. No, no all first he just said, oh, I spied on Derby. Yeah. He's not like I can't believe this. Can't believe it. Called press like conference. What? Everybody thinks he's gonna resign. I just came here to say I spied on all, all of you. you. I do it equally. So it wasn't so just Derby. So no. he, <laughs> he man, the, man had the PowerPoint written. Nah. I can't lie. Bielsa knows more about. Other people's teams and their manager does 100%. Honestly. Honestly. 100%. There was one, it's when, so when wavy. Also, when, it's so when Bielsa first came, <laughs> there was one ex league manager who was, who was like, ah, oh, um, what's Bielsa know about uh, Tuesday night on Rotherham? About Rotherham on like Bielsa? Bielsa he knows. knows. He knows, he knows about the Tuesday night on Rotherham. He knows. We're not going to sit here and. No, 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 no. <laughs> Honestly. Honestly. Bit of guy you got to respect his game. I respect his hustle. Respect that was his actually so wavy because... And uh, British... Well, not British media was so bland, yeah. We're just salt and pepper, yeah. That to... They were like, oh my gosh, wow. Like, <laughs> other teams... Other man... In another country, that wouldn't have trended. Nah, I don't think so. That wouldn't because, have trended. That wouldn't nah, have been a big deal. It would have been whatever. Because I think that's the culture in a lot of other countries here. And you know what's, make, what's hurting the FA and that? He didn't break the law. Yeah. Like they're thinking, how are we gonna punish? How can you punish a man that's he's he's doing Leeds a favor by being their manager? So <laughs> boy, punish him, just deduct these points. Yeah. He can kick, but hey, yeah. ain't man in the rule books as well. I can't lie, I love it when he's and the good thing about managers is when they resign or when they leave, they do a tell talk. Like they come out, they come on interviews, or they will write a book. But like Mourinho, do you see Mourinho's yeah. being? Yeah, a little segue right there. You like that? Like, I'm, I'm trying. Decent, I'm trying. trying. Do you see Mourinho's um interview? Yes, I'm so happy I don't have to listen to this guy. <laughs> oh, Dude, I saw you retweet it. I said, Lord. firstly, yeah, that no, that interview, yeah, because Mourinho, as much as we don't, some people don't like, he's so entertaining and yeah. he's yeah. very likable when he's off, when he's not your manager. In that interview, he spoke about how we had to avoid the stadium ban and be in the laundry room. Mm. And the no, he snuck through the laundry. Like, the that's, laundry the that's, that's the entertainment. That's hilarious. That's the entertainment that we your everybody wanted when you came to United. Because it's a thing where like I did what I did like again. Yeah, that's that's the that's the Mourinho everybody wanted, but but when he comes out and says shameless stuff like I'm the reason Salah was at Chelsea, you're just there thinking, bro, stop lying. You picked Shola, you picked Cordrado, you picked Oscar, you picked all these men over me. So you picked all these men over Salah because you didn't believe. Don't try to say it. He said they got rid of him, he didn't know. I'm thinking, bruh. He's trying to rewrite Yeah, stop yeah. trying to do that, man. Because if Salah comes out, because Salah would know what they're yeah. You would know if you're... And I can't lie, just... Like, everybody saw it. You didn't trust him. Like, you sent him out alone. You didn't really... So what happened with Bruyne then? So is he gonna, did he explain the brand? Because, boy, is that one not you as well? Because are they all just not you? Sometimes he said that He said everyone, the media gets the philosophy wrong. Like when you hear it's the same thing over and over again, you start believing it's the truth. That's what yeah, when it's talking about yeah, um, I saw that one. the right. way in which he plays. But Mourinho is an absolute character. The Prem misses you, but no, just stay no, a bit no, away. No, stay away. Stay away. 100%. 100%. <laughs> nobody misses you. Well, yeah, don't listen to Chelsea. <laughs> Mourinho, don't listen to him. Nobody misses you. Stop. Don't listen to Chelsea. He said his next job, he's going to react. He's going to speak to the club properly and reevaluate because. You lot didn't really give him pee, more or less. No, this said. is why I say I tell everybody lie in your job interviews. Lie, <coughs> lie, and lie. Mourinho told us when he came here he's going to stick to United traditions. He's going to play attacking football. He's going to play he young. He said he didn't have the players. Huh? No. This is what he told us when he first came. He will, he will play attacking football. United philosophies, young Man, players. Will break away from what he does all the time. No, but that's what he, that's what he told the board. He, yeah, told, yeah. he told them. I, I, I don't speak French. I'll stick 
long I told I'll meet your philosophy. When I got my job, I told them I speak French. That's them. what you gotta do. You gotta, you gotta throw I some lines into them. Bro. One bit of French, bro. Not one some French. Emery, throw some lines into them. Told them, oh no, Ozil Stop talking about Emery. He's still, he's still in the job. Stop talking about Emery. He's still in the job. He's still in the job. He's still in the job. Have some respect. And now what's happened? Sorry, let's guys. I have transfers. You from a picture, guys. He lied through. Explain. He from a line through the skin of his teeth. Lied. And what? He's got a job now. He's got a job. Desperate, yeah, for for change. Yeah, we took anyway. Arteta didn't lie. That's where he went wrong. Henri tried to tell the truth. Tried to say he loves the club. They don't care. They don't care. You should have lied. Oli Ball. Let's talk Oli Ball. Rashford. Easy money for him, man. Rashford, numbers. What's he on now? What's he got? Seven? Don't worry about the numbers, man. We don't really look at the numbers. Let me get the numbers. Let me just get the numbers up, right? Ball is ball. Ball is ball. Rashford's a baller. Ball is ball. I see you shameless dons putting him beside Mbappe. Hey. Stop, man. Rashford's on eight. Rashford's Rashford's on eight. Pogba's on eight. Martial's on eight. Lukaku's still on eight. Eight what? Goals. Prem goals. The season? Yeah. Early in the season, he was the one scoring for you, he was never scoring. No, he was scoring. He was, he was not scoring. scoring early in the season. He was, not, yeah, he was never scoring. It's right here. He was not scoring. It's right here. Listen, was, Rashford, I'm hearing Mbappe shouts. Rashford. Look, Rashford and Mbappe eat at the same table. That's that's the bottom line of it. These lot eat from the same plate. Rashford eats at the yeah, foot of Mbappe's table. Stop. Stop. Foot, the toenail Stop. of his table. Stop. They're absolutely Rashford and Mbappe eat at the same table. They order the same food. No, 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 no. And that's what we're going to see in February. That's his grandson. Nah, stop. Mbappe, 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 Rashford is Mbappe. Honestly, 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 in February, if Rashford has to put Mbappe over his knee and give him a little... <laughs> him a little <laughs> to be fair, if we're being honest, I think you're going to pan PSG. I don't know. PSG, but... do you know why? You can't be beating Man Game Camp or whatever they're called, 9-0, bro. Like, There's <laughs> no competition in that. It's not even the farm. Just like the level of competition, yeah. Let me not say there's no competition because Leon come here and they move to City. Yeah. No, but French, I'm saying, league, like, French league is underrated, man. It's, like, it's, it's only because the, the gap. I say the gap is huge. In like the, the gap from top to bottom. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. That's PSG yeah. to the worst teams. Yeah. is very big. But in terms of the mid level, like I feel like the Premier League has destroyed it a lot because the bottom teams in the Premier League have so much more money than the bottom teams and other teams on, mm, across the league, mm. across the across Europe, across the globe. That's why it makes it look a bit destroyed. But in terms of the quality in League One, let's not discount it. But I get what you mean, like. It's hard to. I don't think. I don't think they're gonna be able to up their levels like that. And we're gonna. Everyone is going to get onto Neymar if PSG don't get this result. Two shells gone. If they. Nah, if they. Nah, two. Nah, two shells gone, bro. If PSG. If PSG lose yeah, to so United. Got two seasons. If PSG lose to and United. Got seasons, you got two seasons. But if PSG nah, lose to no. United. And they definitely like two shells more than Emery. So. True. There's no okay. way we'll two shells will go after one. We'll see. We'll see. Um, should we talk some transfers quickly? Yeah, go on. Because with Sari, with what's going on in Chelsea, yeah, and this whole top four thing, luckily this whole top four, is, the top four race is juiced up in January, so you can actually go out and be like, right, let's ma- let me quickly ride my runs. Mm-hmm. Sorry, you think he's going to get his boy? Nah, I think yeah. that Iguain deal is already sorted. You think Where it's Patton? No, nah, it's Patton. He didn't sure. start, he didn't start this um, today. He didn't start. They see when I, went, I don't know who they're playing. Nah, Gattuso even said... Uh, he wasn't on the bench. No, nah, Gattuso said... Um, he's been patterned. Yeah, basically said it's been panned. You'll be a Chelsea player by Tuesday, probably. But um, Tuesday has no no shame. Man just opens it up and said that. Um, whether it'll be a good signing, different case. He's 31, 32 signing. 32. 32. And he hasn't had the best season. And where? They're having a man. It'll be difficult, like, whether he comes into this team and um, instantly changes it, because that's what Chelsea need right now. Mm-hmm. They, they don't need somebody that's going to take their turn to bed into the league. They need... He got they need time to hit the ground running. Morat wasn't even in the squad, bro, against yeah, Arsenal. He was on his way to Atletico Madrid. Is that real? Yeah, that's real. What must it be like? Is it is it just um um the Spanish teams just being real nationalists and sticking with Morat? Were they actually rating him or what? Because I don't. Because even before like, the thing, I was I was hearing no, it was Atletico. It wasn't Real. It was Atletico that wanted him straight. Yeah, you're right. I was expe- I was I was hearing. I'm thinking, wait, what? Like, what's going on? Oh yeah, they're playing Genoa. They'll play um um Milan playing Genoa tomorrow. I think he's not, and he didn't travel with them. No, he's, he's gone. Yeah, he's gone. Um, but yeah, um, who else? Hazard, would you stay? Because I can't lie. I'm I've not, been trying to go, but is this worth a uh, Real Madrid one at this point? I think I don't think they can afford him. Real Madrid. Hey. When last was their last big transfer? James Rodriguez, maybe. 
2014, bro. That's five years ago. Nah, if Real Madrid won, they can push the ball out on time because they're gonna have to re- they're gonna break up this squad. And the squad is breaking. The squad, like the two big teams, yeah, the Barca's and the Reals. Their squad slowly, those elite squads are slowly papering away. So no, is like the, the, the team is still basically. I'm saying at the end of this season, that Real Madrid squad is gonna look very different. They're gonna get rid of a lot of players. But who they're, the back line? Not the back line. Really. The back line staying, bro. Who else? Because Marcelo will probably. No, nah, I don't think Marcelo will be eased out, but. They'll probably send another left back to compete with him because they'll need a better left back to. Carver House stay in. Um, Benzema Moran probably stay in. Bell, I feel like they'll sell Bell if they can. If, if 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 Tottenham Tottenham are one elite signing away from winning something series, if Tottenham are smart, they'll go back and get Bell. But I don't think he wants to go back there. He wants to stay in Real Madrid. He wants to stay in Madrid, but. Why did you say he wants to stay in Madrid? Because he loves it there. He knows that if he could, um, it's no more language barrier. It's all good. Yeah, he's he's been loving it there. It's people, it's people in Madrid that's been saying... Um, Isco. Kovacic is coming back. All of these players, they can go, man. Isco, Kovacic, all of them. Man. Coming back. Bruce, Modric. Modric. Modric's going to go into Milan, apparently. Yeah, Modric to Inter, yeah. But I don't think... You're right in that, like, the squad... All the, the two... Spa- to me, the two big Spanish... The two big Spanish clubs, are more so Real Madrid than Barca, are like papering away in that. No, I don't the revamp. Think. Barcelona. No, 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 I mean... I feel like Barcelona squad's looking decent-ish, like. But it seems like no one's settled. Coutinho wants to leave, apparently. No. Uh, Malcolm didn't settle in well. Um, Dembele didn't settle in well. Um, and then the under the underbed of the centre mids, like the Denis Suarez, the Toro Vidal, and all these lot, ain't really, like, hit the ground. Do you get what I'm trying yeah, to say? I what so, saying, but, but I don't see Barca doing... Barca are still, like, they're still top of the league. They're still mm, in the Champions League. Yeah, still. yeah. I don't feel see them doing a big revamp. But so, Real Madrid, Real Madrid, but the, hmm, if they want Hazard, maybe, I don't think they can afford it. No, they can, I feel like they can. Like they've still got Galactico signings in them if they want to do. It. If mm-hmm. they want to do it, they've still got it in them. Maybe this Paris, is not. Paris, Paris, they're not Arsenal. Available. They're not Arsenal. Stop. What are you talking about, bro? Because they, you're actually. How did yeah. our name come into this? Bro? They haven't signed. They haven't made a big name signing in like five years. A man bringing up Arsenal. Arsenal is a club which. Cannot what are you talking about? Right. Real Madrid can still kind of. You've got your chest back since Oli's come back no, to this stop. club. Bro. It's always been there, man. It's, it's never, been, it was never there. He used to be mad timid on this couch. No, no, it's no, no, not one timid on this couch. Not one timid. Callum out to the door. Let him go, man. Chelsea, just let him go. You, you know what's shameless, yeah? <laughs> sorry, you know, when sorry, you're always like being When your girl's like, I'm babe, I'm leaving. Then you start getting trims, trying to take her, shard and all this stuff. Just because you don't want to see her spread her wings. That's what Callum Hunter is doing at Chelsea. Sorry, you're literally. just giving Some, him little time. Somebody was stepping on Sarah's there. Yeah. Someone was stepping on Sarah's Just play him. Just play him. Play him. Give him 10 minutes. Give him 10 play minutes. Him. Just to let... What are you doing? No. Just let him go. As soon as, as soon as all the talk kind of quieted down this week, back on the bench. <laughs> back. <laughs> literally. <laughs> no, and then, exactly. you know, two, these are two nil down. He throws him on 10 right. minutes left. See, Save the game. Save the game. You, if you're bad, save the game. If you're bad, save the game. you're bad, save the game. I think Bayern should get Zaha. Yeah. Because I think, firstly, Kalamazov Kalama, is a lot younger, obviously, and for longevity. But Bayern, um, but Zaha will be a lot, will be hit the ground a lot, running a lot quicker, sorry. Proven. And I think, so can't go wrong. I think he'll rip up. What you're saying is my boy Zaha can play at the highest level. 100%. See, this is not what they were all saying before. This no, but, no, but I wasn't. This is not. See? I wasn't saying that before. What? So what? What? It takes a big man to admit it, bro. <laughs> it takes a big man to admit it as well. Either way, I don't feel like that um, fits in with Bayern's policy of buying young and relatively cheap. Zaha will probably have to pay 71 yeah. million. No, and no. That's if if, if, if Bayern come to Palace for like 50, 60 mil, 60 mil, not, 60 mil, they'll have I don't think that's what they're trying to do. Mm. They're trying to buy a young German player, young players, like, young players from around the globe. Can I answer those German? No, but I'm saying young German Oh, even German or young, young ones around exactly. the globe. To replace the veterans and the Robins and Rivers. What about Arsenal? You might have shopping at Salvation on them, man. Alright. Um, anyone else? Any other transfers? Because I uh, you can't you just dis bruv. We can't afford no one and we know. So why are you being rude for? I'm alone. I didn't say yeah. I didn't honestly, say Honestly, what reason do you have for buying Dennis Suarez? That's, that's There's no like that's honestly that's not, you need some new drip and you ain't got none. <laughs> You just want new drip. So you get fake them. AirPods. <laughs> Literally. Bruv, I can't lie. Nah. With the, tra- with the transfers, 
with Arsenal's transfer, it's just so hurtful. So that's why I really have to be happy when we beat teams like Chelsea and that. Because that's all we have. That's it. Like, we have to just look forward to the game because ain't no big names coming in. Just go get enough. Just go get enough. Go, go, sure. go get some Reese Nelson shirts or something, man. Honestly, put, put Reese Nelson on your back now. I hope he never leaves you. <laughs> Guys, it's been real. Like, comment, subscribe, <laughs> all of that.